Here I figured I'd give everybody a little walk around to the setup. Uh, it's my 2000 Jeep Cherokee Sport. A little bit rotted from some out of wonderful Ohio weather. We walk around. Let's check it out. Um, up front, got GP terminals, two runs, a certified base head, two watt to the rear, two runs of big three to the Mechman 240. Nothing super fancy. The start of the door pods which I haven't had time to get in and deal with yet. Family comes first before the toys. Uh, the other side is templated out, ready to go, but I still have to pick up the other set of speakers before I can go and get that put in. Get back a little bit farther. There we have the Sundown NS1. V1, all hooked up, mess of wires, it's all gonna end up getting rewired because there will be another sub down the road and a different amp. Now we get to the beef. It's the North Star AGM 220, DC level six, 18, full carbon fiber cone, uh, inverted right now. As soon as I can get somebody to help me out flipping it over, it's going to get flipped around and put back into the box. The enclosure is five cubes as it sits now without the sub in it, without the sub displacements, five and a quarter. Uh, the box was built from Josh Wally from the Custom Box Shop here in Ohio. Did a wonderful job, man. I love this box. It's gorgeous. As soon as I can, you know, it's not a light sub. As soon as I can get somebody to help me flip it around, then we'll be back in business. Eyes amp, hard to see over there, but that's a Synergy 4 channel, the 4.150X. Awesome amp, Synergy is so underrated. Plans are for another North Star, maybe a Lithium. I'm debating on doing that right now. I'm not positive, haven't decided yet. Just for the sheer cost of them, I don't know if I'm gonna end up doing it, but the weight's becoming a problem too. There's a lot of a lot of sag going on. But repping everybody that's gave me the money or gave me the parts, the equipment. I'll show anybody love if they make the good part or the good equipment. I don't have a problem with it. Nothing super fancy inside. Pioneer Double Den, AVH, X480 Bluetooth. Um, the front battery is almost dead. It's kind of hard to see, but you can't see what the voltmeter says right now. It's filthy in here too, but it's sitting at 14 flat. The front battery needs replaced. It's starting to bloat, leak a little bit. But for right now, that's what we're working with. As this channel develops and as I can get more videos, I'll get some demos for you. It's pretty nasty for one sub, I'll give it that. But I'm looking for more. It's always a never ending upgrade. It never ends. Anybody that's truly into this knows that it's, once you're in it, it's hooked. You're hooked, you can't get out of it. I'm, I'm an older guy. I've been doing it since my first car. There, I'll never stop doing it. But until the next video, peace out. Keep it loud.